guys, it's the hottest day on record, or it will be, 38 degrees, it is hot, but I love it, I don't care, I'm not moaning, anything over 18 here is a slight panic for everyone, like, but yeah, we're off to the bus stop, we've got three minutes till the bus gets here, so stay tuned, I'm off to Coptal, Allianz Stadium, or Allianz Park, whatever it's called, um, the home of the Saracens, uh, there's a tag rugby match, all in the name of charity, so I'm going to go and support a few friends of mine who are down there playing. So let's roll, if we get this bus. Right. So yeah, waiting for the bus, the two bus station, um, going to Edgware, the 221, to get to Coptal. Well, a bit of walking from there, but yeah. Now I'll wait. Wait for the bus. Again. So we made it, we're at Coxall Stadium, it's not hot that I don't want to really be out there, in the heat, can't see anyone I know yet, could be hidden somewhere, in the shade, there's rugby going on. Tell you what though, everything is easier when it's hot. Well, I mean like, do you know what I mean? You don't have to worry about getting cold, none of that bullshit. Do you know what I mean? Winter is like fucking annoying. Yeah, that's what I mean. I'm on the running track. You're saying bolt right here. I feel like an Olympian. It's a joke. I race ya. Right, where's the starting line? Right here. And then go. Oh yeah, the head start, man.
the winners of the plate. Oh, sorry, over there. Can't see the photographer for looking. Thank you very much. Strategically placed. So give them a round of applause. They come up onto the stage. This is one plus one. The winners in the room here this afternoon. So I'm sure you'll all agree it's a well-deserved award. And they've all managed to raise lots and lots of money. And we've even got a dancer on stage to commemorate that. The biggest fundraisers. Please give them a massive round of applause. Team Warriors, come on up please guys, Team Warriors. You will get yourself a signed shirt from Owen Farrell to thank you for your tables if you'd like to get involved with us next year. We're hoping to grow this year on year. But before I say cheerio and a safe journey and to get to the bar for everybody to have a drink, I'd just like to hand over to two guys who, shh, who are massively important in making sure this day happens. So I mentioned them earlier, these days just get, don't get thrown together. There's a lot of hard work and it's not just Sean and Joe's will come on to talk about, it's a team behind it. tech shop, have a look, same old stuff, might sell some old PS4 games or DVDs but maybe not, see how it goes, I haven't brought any with me so I can't, but maybe next time, they're not worth much though, my god after that heat of yesterday, didn't think I could get anything done, was planning to go like central London but it was raining this morning so Sun came out, I just had to get out somewhere. Better than staying at home. And because it's going to rain tomorrow more, so. From 38 degrees, we're down to what? More than 10 less than that. It's like 24 now, I think. So that's really weird. The temperature just dropped. The rain, it was raining all night as well, so. I, I decided yesterday, like, I'm not going to go out today if it's raining, if there's no blue sky. What's the point? It wouldn't be good for the vlog, really. So I'm continuing. So yeah, I took a shortcut up Union Street. Here we are, in the pub again. It's not as sunny as I'd like, but that's England. One day it's really hot, next day it's like raining and Weird, anyway. Can never get used to it. Just can't wait to get to Italy. But they're suffering in the heat over there, mind you. Right, guys out of the pub and on the way to the bus stop to go home again because it's around that rush hour time eat some dinner obviously can't be missing that, I'm Italian you know what I mean don't miss dinner time we eat and we eat properly so or we eat a lot that's the right word in large amounts But yeah, I've never been to that pub in the daytime, it's normally at night. But that's the first time. Um, so, yeah, it was nice. Different atmosphere in pubs in the daytime. Or free houses, as they used to be called. Like, just been out so many days that anything like this feels boring compared to what I'm normally doing. Because I was going to go to Trafalgar Square on a big day out, but there weren't enough blue sky. And it was raining, so don't really want to do that. As committed as I am to helping you guys and making a good vlog for you guys and for myself to enjoy and look back on, I don't want to get soaked. And yeah, I was planning to add that to this vlog, but I just stayed local instead. So yeah, whatever you're doing, enjoy. It's Friday, guys. Thank God it's Friday. 
been a long week, but in a good way. But still, thank God it's Friday. I mean, it might have been a bit too early for me to go to the pub, but what the hell? Anyone says anything, then I'll sort them out, you know what I mean? I'm the boss around these parts. Don't tell me what to do. Alright guys, signing off. If you can even hear me anymore. Of all this traffic. Where is the bus stop? Oh, almost there. Alright. Hopefully a better vlog next time. But the first half of this vlog was awesome, so... Yeah. It's not all bad. And it's Friday. Peace.